Mm. Is it me time? Yeah, right. Me time to say this. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, whatever country you're in, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm going to do the same little message that Justin does in the Charlie Ward shows. Right, the granddaughter made me do it. Oh, what's this flying at me? Oh, did you see it just flew at me? Oh, anyway, I have to focus, Bubba Bertha. This is not about me. This is about you watching the program, subscribe, shares, and like, do this. She said, you have to do this. I haven't got a clue why. Don't do that. Do this. All right. That looks a, bit, a little bit rude to me. I'm very, very sorry. But she said that she gets the subscribers, then she could start to stream. I don't know what that means either. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this program. Well, I hope you do. Sometimes she puts her heart and soul and everything else into it. As she said, she won't even let me go and have me bath. I want to go and have me bath. So please watch the program and then do this, subscribe and share, and come on to Moving On TV. There it is down below. I can't see it, but you can see it. Oh, I don't get this anymore. I don't understand what's going on. And where we go one, we go all. I, I don't know what she's talking about. And have a nice, have an, have a nice day. Yeah, you see, I don't know what we're talking about. And please watch me programs. I better go. You won't watch this. Goodbye. Hey guys, welcome to the awakening. And today I think it's number seventy-four, something like that. <laughs> so I'm really glad that you're watching and you're enjoying the awakening and that it's helping. And um, today I want to talk about moving on TV because um, I don't know if a lot of you actually know what it is. It's not a channel, guys. I'm not running a channel. I intend to run a whole moving on TV, a whole TV station. You know, the equivalent of when the mainstream will go. ITV, BBC, a proper TV station to get it on the box um, so that we can have the equivalent of a powerful, unique TV station where everyone is a celebrity and I'll tell you why and where this has come about. Well, you know, people contact me and they say, that, oh, why do you worry so much and uh, upset, get upset about other people and their sadness and what they're going through and I say, well, because I'm part of humanity, my job is to help others and to be part of that with the work that I do. Well, I, I was held back continuously for years and years and years. I could not get on the media because I was not one of those, one of that lot. And my message was positive, my message was love, my message was compassion, innocence. And of course I didn't fit the mould. So all my talents were held back. And I had lots of them. From about the age of six, I was on the stage. I've got websites with people comparing me, saying I'm better. Than, you know, I don't want to go into all the amazing testimonials of my work. People who have seen my work, they know. Um, but the thing is that I could not get on the media in order to get any bigger, in order to grow with the talents that I had. So I decided... 2014 we were in Edinburgh, sold out Edinburgh and couldn't get on the media even though I sold it out the first time I was there and so me and Jake Creswick, he was 14, started moving on TV. I took it back now in The Awakening a couple of months ago to grow it and it's growing like wildfire compared to the way it was. Um, when people contact me, they say, oh, we're sorry you're in pain and look at Nassara and Jasara and, you know, telling me all this stuff that's coming that I already know anyway, um, which is kind of them, but you have to understand, you can't take away my pain. You have to understand something. Everything that's worthwhile comes from a huge amount of pain. I mean, look at a baby. When a baby is born, a baby is born from huge pain and suffering. And then this beautiful baby comes into the world. So this new awakening is coming in, kicking and screaming. And moving on TV is the TV station that is opening that door to everyone, every single person. First thing is we barter. <laughs> Where have you ever heard of a TV station or media that barters? That if you want to get your product done, we barter? We're happy to barter. We find a way where we can work together. It's not about money. Yes, if you have the money, that's fantastic. Because there are other people who want barter. Like, for example, you have to pay the rent. But we barter. 
and we're very happy to do it as long as we can work together in some way and we both grow. Moving on TV is about you. You are all unique celebrities. There is no unique person as far as I'm concerned. We're all unique. And that's the difference to the media. I particularly welcome people over 70, 80, 90. I don't care, 100, whatever. All ages, all groups, all abilities to come and do their own shows because we're the opposite to the mainstream. We report on children, sex trafficking, paedophilia, this thing, 5G. I don't care anymore. We report on everything that needs to be reported on. We tell you that medication for, for mental health is not going to work. You're just going to get numb and you're not going to recover because they don't want you to recover. We tell the truth. And I don't care anymore what people think. We go out there and fight your corner. That's what Moving On TV is. And, I, and that's why I want people to watch The Awakening today and understand what Moving On TV is. It is not a channel where we just put on The Awakening or one program here or there. We're a TV station. We provide entertainment, comedy. Um, at some point, maybe we'll make our own detective stories or soaps or whatever. Got one in the pipeline, Encounters, the musical. We might have to do that as a series, who knows, a musical series like Glee. Um, we provide you with heroes like today, Joseph Ole Tipanko, uh, Chief Joseph of the Maasai, who goes out there and has offered a space and refuge to young little girls instead of them having to be married off to old men. Paedophilia. You know, we show you the truth. The media won't tell you anything. All they talk to you about this stupid virus, which is just a flu bug, and it's a, a cover for the sex trafficking and all the terrible things that are going on to innocent people in the world. It's the cover for the enslavement of the human race. And if you don't know that by now, I urge you to wake up quickly because young people are getting on Instagram and they're highlighting stuff that's going to break your heart. Broke my heart this morning. Had a good cry. But like, what am I doing in this Sodom and Gomorrah hellhole? Maybe Nassara and Gassara is coming. I don't know. I can't make any promises. I don't know. I hope it is. And then there will be opportunities for all of us to shine. But as I say, Moving On TV is a TV station. And my big goal, um, I was quoted £600,000 for half an hour on the box. That was before the awakening. As we get closer and closer to the mainstream going, I expect there will be a space for us Moving On TV and you on the box. So get involved now with us so we can grow together. Because at some point, people will be knocking on my door and I won't be bartering with people that have money. I will get it paid as well. The bartering is for people that don't have anything. The bartering is for people like myself that all the salary of their husband, the tiny salary, goes to the landlord. Okay? The bartering is for people that can't work, single mums disabled people that can't get benefits, whoever, come to me and we'll discuss it. If you've got money, you can pay because you've got money and it's an exchange. So all I'm saying is Moving On TV is there for everyone as long as you are promoting love, compassion, awakening, dark to light, highlighting what everyone needs to see in order to wake up and to release innocence to free the children, to free the Falun Dafa. Wonderful people like Mitchell, Nicholas Gerber, um, Chief Joseph, Charlie Ward, um, David Mahoney, Kate Shimriani, Rebecca Briggs, all these incredible people, people Rebecca Kahn, these are people, Je Gez Ter Terangio, uh, who goes out to highlight what they're doing to children, the experiments on kids in hospitals. People like that, I don't even think about getting anything back. All I want to do is do my work. So help us, help Moving On TV to be part of the awakening. Come on board Moving On TV, bring your talents. Like some of you have already brought your talents on here. And as I say, it comes from intense pain. 
Moving on TV was born from a huge, frustrated, talented woman, myself, I'm not afraid to say so, who went through hell, who wasn't allowed to perform anywhere, couldn't perform anywhere. If you didn't have the money or you didn't have the celebrity status, didn't matter how talented you are, didn't matter how your musicians weren't talented, didn't matter what else, what, what you got back, the feedback, the testimonials, I was actually told by loose women, they would not put me on. This was Katie Price and these awful, awful robotic, God knows, transgender things that are walking around that um, hopefully will be gone soon, either executed or disappeared off the face of the planet because we don't want them anymore. Puppets that have been used to condition good human beings and teach you that you can't do anything with your life. Well, guess what? I'm telling you, you can do everything with your life. Come on board Moving On TV and prove it. Bringing the hope and glory back into our lives. I hope this program on The Awakening, because I'm getting 150 views now for The Awakening. It's very exciting. It's jumped about 10, 10 times as much and because you want to know what's coming. I cannot give you um, the, the news of Gisara and Nassara, I don't know anything about that. I just listen to the other people that are setting up groups and I pray to God there will be lots of money for humanitarian causes like moving on TV or moving on theatre because I've got actors that are being thrown out, evicted from their homes and I can't pay them either because there is nowhere for me to get enough money to run the projects, the humanitarian projects that I run. But on a happy note, Moving On TV is there for you. Moving On TV is your TV station. It's not a channel, it's yours. You can come on, you can do your own shows, you can get sponsorship, you can sponsor yourself, you can join with us like a hub. Rebecca Briggs from Biomineral Balance is giving 10% off her wonderful hair analysis to find out what you're deficient in and what you've got too much in. Prepare yourself for what's coming in October. Get yourself well now before they push any more flu bugs on us. Be careful. Be careful. Learn the truth from moving on TV, from the questions and answers. Watch the tarot show. It's fun. And now you can, if you subscribe now, you can get a free tarot reading with me. You can win a free tarot reading with me, free hypnotherapy session with Martin Ottawa, qualified hypnotherapist, free life coaching or Louise Hate counselling with myself, I'm trained. If you live in the area, reflexology. Uh, so join Moving On TV, subscribe. And I am ready, willing and able to give you the good news, the positive news, but news flashes of what you need to know. So you need to contact me if you've got a very important story like Lady X who came on to tell us about Watford Hospital. So at least some of you know now what to be aware of if you have a high temperature or women complaints. I better go, my beanbag's getting wet. Love you lots. Please subscribe, moving on TV1 at gmail.com. Contact me. Love you lots. Bye.